Hi there, I'm Peter and this is Peter's Milano Qigong. Today I will talk about a simple Qigong exercise or shaking. Shaking of body. It is the simplest exercise I know and it's holistic. It will bring many benefits to your body and it will help release energy blockages. Among major benefits of this exercise is relaxation. What is most important about it is that it is so simple and natural that you don't need to know anything. No theory, no technique, no nothing. In fact, if you were an average healthy kid growing and playing outside during your childhood, you might have done it purposely and without even knowing anything about it except that it is pleasant and sometimes when it is needed suits your mood. When we were children, I'm talking about pre-puberty, sometimes even before we reached seventh year, we used to do many Qigong exercises that seemed like a natural movements at that time. Nothing fancy, completely from the gut. One of them is shaking, but not the only one. For example, chanting OM is something that little children also do while they sing to themselves doing the HUM sound, which is sang through nose in snuffling sound. And if an adult would ask that child, what are you doing, kid? The answer would probably be, just playing. Do you play a game of life? Enough that the daily and usual stuff that you are doing are like a child's play. Do you need things to be complicated, sophisticated and artificial enough to, to even start doing them because those things matter? Oh, you will be scored at the end. Well, guess what? There are no scoring in life, at least not the real, the real one. In real life you get what you wish for and if your life becomes complicated, it is time to simplify it. This exercise, like I said, many of us already know. It is a whole body shaking. It is natural, like a children's play. In this exercise, you are standing in a normal stance which is described in many of our posts, so go and search for it. To start, you lift on the toes and then sink down on your heels. Now, maintaining your feet in a full contact with the floor, you start shaking your body lightly and gently. You might increase the strength of shaking during the exercise, but don't start too forcefully or it won't be so beneficial. When you start shaking, you, you will first start feeling the vibrations in muscles and your skin. You might get into a deeper connection with parts of your body like legs and arms, but after a minute or maybe some more, this feeling will increase and deeper deepen into deeper tissues like bones, nerves and organs. Later, after a couple of minutes more, you might start feeling your body as a whole. Parts of the body mentioned before might start to connect into one deeper wholeness. This might be a fascia beginning to resonate with your shakings. Be gentle with your shaking or you might lose this feeling of wholeness. Fascia is very delicate and gentle tissue. For advanced practitioners, here I just say, from here you can go to the energy body or matrix or to the marrow brain inside the bones. When you have relaxed into your body in such a deep way that you can feel your fascia and your body as a whole, you are 
physically relaxed and now you can start leading the chi. You can lead it into your organs, bones, meridians or marrow brain. In order to really lead the chi, you need to be relaxed as much as possible. One of the simplest ways to relax into your body is doing some form of qigong. The simpler it is, the better it serves to the purpose of relaxation. Relaxation of the body is the fundamental thing in cultivating anything inside yourself. Body is the vessel into which the consciousness will pour itself, wisdom will be attained, feelings experienced, thoughts thought, life lived and so on. But if your body is not relaxed, you will be obstructing the flow and experience. We tend to do so today. Therefore, if you are in any way interested in experiencing more of flow of life and energy chi, start shaking, not wildly, but gently, like you don't care about anything. Do it slowly until you start feeling happy. And you will, as these gentle shakings will massage the glands in your brain and those glands will start producing the good feeling hormones and suddenly you will feel even more relaxed than before. You might also add some that mmm sound or hmm sound. It doesn't matter as long as you know why you are doing this. Mm. It will help you find the center in your brain where is the Shen's residence. It will also additionally massage glands and tissues inside your head. Be gentle and soft. Remember how children are doing this. Well, don't exceed that amount of sound, volume or movement. Don't do it proportionally. Do it as a small child. When you are shaking, Trust yourself and close your eyes. After some time, when you will have your eyes closed, you might start feeling like your body will want to tip over, forward. However, it is a false feeling of your sacrum being released inside the sacroiliac joint. And now it started moving freely. I should mention that this is the point from where you cannot return. Qigong will have you for the rest of your life. This freedom of sacrum is a major indicator of health and life force within a body. And when this bone is released in that way, all things in the body have the potential to return to its equilibrium. It means that you can get healthy if you were sick. Your condi conditions will be changed in a beneficial way. You can go on and shake yourself for as long as you choose to, but I recommend you to start with moderate timing. Few minutes for a start will be just enough. Increase it gradually until you reach 10 or 15 minutes. It should be enough. You will enjoy it, I'm sure. And if you would ask me if there is anything I should do today for a start of my Qigong practice at home, I would say, well, do the shaking. Now you know how to do it, so do it. And relax and smile and enjoy. It is just the beginning of a wonderful journey. May the Qi be with you. Bye.